Oh, I'm so excited. <laughs> Hi, everyone. Um, <laughs> I am here to share with you something that has me really excited. That right now, this moment is here. Let me put the event link in here. Um, this very moment is Saturday, um, what is today's date, February 20th at 10.48 a.m. And um, today, Eastern Standard Time at 2 p.m. on my uh, online school, bonitawoods.org, we are hosting the most amazing program. We are hosting a time-bending class. It's only $44.44, a sacred 4444, which has a lot of action and power in it. Uh, we're hosting a class with Time Master Kim. Uh, some of you may have seen her on recent live streams with me, and I just want to share with you a little bit about what we're going to do in case you're wondering, time bending, I don't even get that, so why would I take it? Kim is like, she knows how to just step outside of time and treat time like a tool to be utilized as she needs it to be for her present moment. We're going to learn how to take this period of time and like compress it or stretch it out. Like suppose you are in a situation that you're like, oh my God, I wish this would hurry up. You can compress it. Or suppose you're in a situation where you go, I need more time. You can pull it out. We, um, there's also other fun things, other fun tidbits. I just want to tell you when I, when the last time Kim hosted this class, because then she went off living in other parts of the world for a number of years, uh, she hosted it when we had our actual physical wellness center years ago. And um, it was so much fun. <laughs> Everyone had such a great time. Of all the events and classes I hosted over the seven and a half years that my very busy wellness center with 30 to 40 events every month. This was far and away the most requested class for a repeat I ever had. More and more people who, those who attended it wanted it again. And those who didn't attend were jealous and wanted to come back and have it. But Kim was off in Europe, so they were out of luck. Uh, but now she's back and we have her online. It's going to be amazing. I'll tell you some of the side effects I had from practicing Kim's techniques have been, I actually began seeing things that happen a little ahead of me. Uh, I've shared the story of where I was driving and I had to drive to a T-junction and then make a right turn and then go just a few blocks away. It just was like nasty weather. And I had, um, it was like an area that is not pleasant to walk. I was in the car two blocks away. I could see at the T-junction, there was the red lights going. And I'm like, man, a cop pulled someone over. That's really awful on a day like today because I knew there was a speed trap like a block back. I got to the T-junction, there's no cop car there. I'm like, I know I saw it. You know what it looks like when you see the red lights and they have the red reflection going around. And I was like, that's so weird. So I went and I ran my errand. I just had, and then came back. It was really quick, just a few minutes. And as soon as I turned to go back down that T-junction, there's a cop car pulled someone over and it was exactly like the cop pulled, the car that was pulled over was the same one I had seen. I'm like, wow, that's weird. Uh, also, like one time I was walking with my youngest son and he was like, we're walking to a playground and it's like in a street where there's no traffic. So we're kind of, there's no real sidewalk there. So we're walking on the side of the road and he started skipping ahead. He's like, 
I don't know, 15 yards ahead of me. And I saw him trip and face plant with his face hitting the, uh, the cement, you know, side of the road that goes to them, uh, you know, and I would like any mother, I went running over to scoop him up. And as I got up to him, which was like three seconds later, and I put my arms out to lift him up, he fell right into my arms and it, there was no face plant. I saw what was about to happen like three seconds before it happened and was able to get there and put my arms out in perfect timing to catch him so he never fell. So weird little things like that, um, you know, and it's been really helpful being able to, uh, you know, make time go a little quicker or a little slower and the fun side effects as you're learning the skill. So I want to show you real quick, let's see if I can do this shared screen. Uh, where is it? Okay. Okay, so I'm, okay, we don't want my Facebook page. Here we are, this is the page at bonitawoods.org where you would register. And we have the course curriculum. If you join us, not only do you get today's class, two hours, but you can click on the free preview. So we have a lot of bonus, okay, it's ugh, making me sign in, so hold on. So obviously I have some work to do on my website so that you can hit free previews without signing in. So I'm gonna go into the course. And as you see, we have um, a little bit of information on time bending. And if you sign up for the course, I'm not gonna show you right now, there's the link to today's class, which is taught on Zoom. And then we have some bonus videos and after today's class, we will add some bonus audio meditation so that you can go back and really practice this skill. Oh, it's gonna be so much fun. And if you're not 100% sure about um, what you're getting into, you can go to the Bonita Woods U YouTube channel. Please subscribe. <laughs> And we have several videos here as well. They're the same videos that are in the course, but they're here along with, you know, several hundred other videos. Um, so that is it. Let me stop the share. That's my cat, <laughs> Maddie. <laughs> okay. So, um, yeah, that's it. I just wanted to share this with you because I am so excited. This is going to be like such an unusual and useful class because we all have moments when we need more time or less time or um, the ability to realize just like with spoon bending that I teach you guys. And if you go spoon bending, go to my website. I have an entire course for free absolutely for free on spoon bending. So um, you see where you learn to do things like this. <laughs> it's really fun. But it's just a reminder that we are not beholden to the laws of science. And as a former scientist, I, I can tell you I'm a big fan of the laws of science. However, we, are, we learn that these are tools for us to use, not to be, you know, enslaved by. And that our way of thinking, our mind, our intention when focused can allow us to accomplish extraordinary feats, things that we otherwise thought were impossible. I've taught people how to take rebar and twist it. If someone can take rebar, and with like no effort, just using your hands and using your mind, just very comfortably bend it. And if someone can make time do what they want, uh, I have levitated my body, I've levitated small objects. I know other people who are much more experienced and advanced with this skill than I am. If we can do this, what else can we do? 
you know, the mind boggles. So listen, have a wonderful day and I hope to see you. If for some reason you see this video and it's after the class is done, don't worry, it's there. You can still buy it and, you know, watch the videos. Feel welcome to contact me if you have any questions. <laughs> Thank you. Bye.